Hello, Mary Beth. How are you, Arthur? Fine. How are you? Um, well, I'm well, I think. It's been quite a run we've had, but, but we're still alive. So, no regrets? Regrets for what? Well, for joining this band of maniacs. If you're a girl without means in this world, life is very scary. You boys care for me before no one cared for me. Well, life weren't very nice, Arthur. Not after Mama got typhoid, and that was a long time ago. Sure. What about you? <clears throat> I heard you ran into that married girl. <laughs> <laughs> yep. And? You got me thinking how that all ended. Long time ago now. What happened? <laughs> well, she didn't love me enough, I guess. I wouldn't change. Huh. Well, she was a fool then, Arthur. Well, she put a lot of good years in on an outlaw. She definitely was a fool. In these books, life seems so simple, but in reality, I, I can't make head nor tail of it. Mr. Morgan! Mr. Morgan, we have a problem. A real problem. It's Tilly. What? She's oh. been taken by them Foreman brothers she used to run with. Come along! The Foreman brothers? What are they doing here? Well, I don't know what they've been doing here, but I can tell you what they're going to be doing here. Dying. Sure. Do we need more guns? You and I can handle this, Arthur. Okay. Where are we heading? I'll tell you on the way. Just get going. All right. All right. Head for Rhodes. And quick. She's in Rhodes? No. She's at a place called Bradley's house, just west of there. How do you know? When we first got here, she told me she was worried that our camp was near a safe house that gang she ran with used from time to time. And you told Dutch? No. She spoke to me in confidence. I suppose I didn't think it would be a problem. Now it is. Oh, yes. What do they want with her anyway? I think I saw one of the foremans hassling her in Valentine. Whoa. I think there's a guard. I'll deal with him. And in need of some help. Oh, get out of here. Oh, I see that kindly face of yours. And I know that for the right inducement, a gentleman such as yourself could be mighty fine. Oh. oh, you keep saying that. But you don't mean nothing by well, I it. I said. You said your last word. Well, what are you waiting for? Get in there and find our girl. <laughs> I'm kicking the door, dude. Open not. What the hell you Open up. Knocked out, boy. I got you, Tilly. It's okay, Miss Tilly. Now, let's get you out of here. I thought there was. Yeah, it don't matter what you thought. It's okay. Right, let's go. Oh, come along, miss. Thank you, both of you. What happened? It was Anthony Foreman. He thinks he owns me. I remember. Where is he? He went out hunting or something. There were five of them, I think. Well, killed those fellas there. There they are. Come on. Tilly, grab that gun. Anyone approaches, shoot them. Oh, don't worry. I'll be just fine. Now, Ooh, let's go. Out. Where y'all going, huh? Clear. Straight ahead. I saw him go through those bushes. You've got a couple more seconds to regret what you did. They're taking down the hill. You've got it. Oh, there they are by the shoreline. Get him out of here, bro. Where you think you're going, young boy? I ain't done with you yet. Come here. Come here, young boy. He ain't getting away, bro. Come on. 
Bring your booty self over here. I gotta get closer, y'all gotta get closer. Am I? Or am I making a big mistake? Come here. That's it. Now make sure you time up real good. Get this off of me. Go on, truss him up. What are you waiting for? Uh, make these nice and tight. All right. You bring that bastard back to Tilly so we can all have a nice little chat. I'm gonna head over there now to check she's okay. With pleasure. I'll take his horse. He won't be needing it no more. Alright, bud. Well, you're gonna go talk to someone, alright? So what you get... You're gonna get a little beating, alright? Step, do you have the first idea what you're getting into? I'm Anthony Foreman. Well, that sounds like Dutch. Introduction, Anthony. Is that Foreman with an A? I want the Undertaker to spell it right. Funny bastard. <laughs> Who are you running with? She didn't tell you? She didn't tell me nothing. Oh, this rope is cutting into me. Don't feel so good when you're the one tied up, does it? She killed my goddamn cousin. Oh, don't worry. You'll be seeing him soon enough. What are you gonna do with me? I ain't sure yet. Reckon I'll let Tilly decide what you deserve. You're wasting your time with that girl. She's a liar. She'll screw you over like she did me. I should have shot the bitch yesterday. Alright. Jeez, alright. Language. Bring him here. Dump him on the ground here. I wanna get a good look at this monster. There you go. So he's still alive then? Ah. Yes. You see this girl? You leave her alone. She killed my cousin. Your goddamn cousin had it coming, Anthony Foreman. I don't care if she shot your daddy and cooked your mama for breakfast. She's mine. She ate yours. You know, a friend of mine, he always says, <clears throat> revenge is a fool's game. Now, you want all your boys dead? She had her reasons. We was family, Tilly Jackson. You Foreman boys ain't no kind of family I want. Kill him, Arthur. You want that? I want him to go away and tell the remaining of his cousins and the clowns he rides with to leave me alone. Now, you think you can do that, Anthony? Or should I slit your throat and just save us all the bother? I'll leave you alone. History is done. History is never done. It's your call, Arthur. But I'd slit his throat. Go on. Finish the. Oh my God! All right, we can either slit his throat or spare him, guys. I've spared enough people in this game. I don't know what's gonna happen, but I feel like if I spare him, he's gonna come back with more people. I I feel like this guy's gonna have more reinforcements. So I feel like if I spare him, he's going to come back. He might even find our camp. Guys, I'm sorry, but not this time. Bastard off. Sadly, I agree with you. Sorry, partner. We can't take no chances with the likes of you. We can't trust him, y'all. I'm not letting Tilly get hurt again, bro. That's not happening. I'm not. No. I'm sorry. Not this time, bud. Not this time. All right. Well, that's done. All right. Um. I got time. To... Shit. My horse is out of whistling range. Bro, I'm sick and tired of my horse, dude. Come on. My horse is back at camp. Is that horse still here? Yeah, I'm about to just take this horse. Yes. Where's that horse got to? Yeah, for real. I'm just take you. Oh, 
come on. Alright, break it up. What you fools up to? Is Mr. Black's fault? His fault to Darky White. Well, I don't know why they call him that. Look at him. Don't you start now. I'll knock the color clean off you. Come on. And I'll right. tell you, you lily livid. Enough. Right. You two fools look like you've just run off a chain gang. Yeah, what up? What are you doing? Starving. They got bounty posters for us all over town. And we can't go into town to get supplies. Say, mister, maybe you can do us fools a favor. We ain't bad guys at all. He's okay. You and for a darkie. Shut it, you pasty face streak of piss. Yeah, I had up to here with you. No. Do your goddamn favor what you want. Maybe you can go into town and take down them wanted posters of us. <sighs> okay. Maybe meet us back at the campfire in the woods and tell us how you did. If maybe bring us a little bite to eat. Don't push your luck. Nice fella. Yeah, you love nice fellas. Don't you start up again. Just shut up. You shut up! <sighs> My god. Every time. Alright. Take down the one of posters. Alright. Ding a ling. Here we go. There's five of them? Oh my god. You know, Ben's bad. Hold your horses, won't be long. I'm starting to debate if these guys are bad or good. Tell me nothing. Thanks, partner. Well, that's one. I don't know where else. Do I gotta like look in shops or something? Out of the damn way. You lost your mind? You won't not pay? Get back to work. I ain't stopping till you're dead. Bro, I don't got time to be fighting old people, bro. down dude don't fight me it ain't a good idea dude I don't know why you trying I'm not gonna loot him because if I do that's gonna consider me I'm gonna get fucking arrested Here we go. I see another one of those things. All right, so they're marked on my map. Sorry, I'm taking so freaking long to do something. Another poster right here. Hey, I need to get to that poster behind you. Will you move a little? <laughs> I will not. Deputy put up plenty. Go get one of those. Please, Mister. I'll just reach by. It won't take but a second. I'm leaning on it. Find one that ain't in use. Hey, move. I need that poster. Oh, I'll move, all right. How's this for moving? No. Bro, I fought enough people already, bro. I'm gonna beat the fuck out of you. Bop. Bada dee bop. Lay down. Give me this. Two out of five, I need three more. Are they getting marked on my map? I hope they are. Taking this dude's hat. It's my hat now. Oh, they're on the they're on the poles. Here's one. Okay. They're on the poles. Alright, I gotta look on the poles. It's three. Here's one. One more to go, y'all. These guys are lucky I'm doing this. I feel like these guys like did something really bad, like they robbed a bank or something. Mm -hmm. 
I need that poster. There's been a recall. I weren't born yesterday. This one's mine, so you can go and get your own. Alright, I'm gonna wait for him to leave and then I'm gonna try I'm gonna um, aim, put my gun at him. I don't wanna shoot, because if I do I'm gonna get wanted and I'll have to run from the cops again. So I'm gonna have to wait for him to get out of here and then I'm gonna put my gun at him. All right, I'm gonna do it now. The hell Get you doing? <laughs> Bro, you're gonna shoot me, dude. Where's that gotten you? Huh? Give me the poster. It's all I want. So when he shoots, y'all don't do nothing. But when I shoot, like, oh, someone's shooting. Give me the poster back, bro. It's my horse now. All right, y'all. Lucky I took this much time to do this for you. You're good. Posters are gone. Hello. I was in town. Pretty hot. There's quite a price on you boys. It is so unfair. I, I didn't do nothing. Well, they said you was wanted for murder. It was a murder? It was self-defense. And you killed a farmer? Well, firstly, I would have, but he died before I could. And secondly, well, he had it coming. He... I don't like to say. Well... Yeah, burn him. Ain't no business of mine. Here's the poster. Thanks, partner. That's that, then. That's that. Free at last. Free from you, at least. Well, not quite. No. Alright, well. Um. I don't know what else I can really do. We're running low on time as it is. I got that for, um, I think, what was it? let me see. Bounty hunting. Yeah, my horse is all the way back in my camp, dude. Look how far I am. Well, I can run that way. It just takes some time, that's all. Okay. So we got someone we gotta look at, we gotta get. I gotta go back to Emerald Ranch. Hosea has a mission. We got a lot of stuff to do, y'all. Alright, y'all. I think I'm gonna end the video here. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. We didn't get that much stuff in this episode. Um, I don't know. Not that really. Not, not that much stuff to do, really, at the, at the moment. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did like the video, comment and subscribe, y'all. And I will see you guys next time for some more Red Dead Redemption 2 action. Um... I gotta get home and get my horse back, so... Donkey, can you give me a ride home, please?